and welcome to a new studio vlog. This week I have to finish a commission and hello. Oh, you want to say hi? Ugh. And think about my business plan. You will also get to see me paint the wall in a beautiful new color. And and the rest is just going to be, as always, an insight into my week with lots of cats videos and storytelling. I painted the wall in a very cute lavender color this weekend because this is not only the place where I work in, it's also my bedroom at the same time. I love what are you doing? Are you waiting for something? Huh? Anyway, what I wanted to say is that I love any kind of purple, lavender, even pink. It's so soothing for my sometimes a little bit anxious mind. <laughs> I'm not the best sleeper when I don't watch out for my bedtime routine. Can easily go towards midnight and I don't do well with that because I cannot sleep in. I basically wake up between six and seven. For me, it's very important to have something in the room to calm myself, which is why I have my art altar and feather here. It's very important for me to have spaces that remind me that I don't have to define myself over my productivity and the outcome that there's a much deeper level to being alive and being here. I tend to be in my head a lot so that's the automatic response is to go into problem solving Surprisingly, that is where room color ties in a lot. If I spend my days in a room that keeps me grounded and focused and has a purpose, then I'm much more likely to just be productive and work on the things as they are. I didn't paint the whole room, you know, the rest of the walls are still white. But this one, it's just one wall, it's not expensive uh, and it has a, a great d impact.
started painting Danita's dog called Saki and Beatrice. Saki is a Shiba Inu, Beatrice is a pug. And I just finished the outlines and will do the watercolor part right now. Danitza has a YouTube channel where she does card readings, intuitive card readings, and I will link her up somewhere here, here. I never know, I think it's this side. So you can take a look at her channel and say hi. When I'm, when I'm working, I like to watch other artists' studio vlogs because it f it's inspiring to me and I feel like I'm not working alone and see them go through their struggles and how they come up with solutions is really interesting for me. Luckily, I don't have any color on this brush because otherwise my hands would be... Never mind. Thank you so much for watching this week's video. I hope you enjoyed it a lot and see you next week. Bye bye. Mm -hmm.